are going to show you a 3D housing apartment. Uh, basically, we will check uh, AutoCAD plan. This is an AutoCAD plan what I've got from the client. And uh, if you see uh, closely, this is a front elevation. In this, uh, we have pillar section, first floor, second floor, third floor, and fourth floor. So if you look closely, this is a first floor have uh, no balcony over here which have alternate balconies so here is a balcony and fourth floor have a balcony so like that uh, we'll check the first and third floor plan that means if you see the plan it's a first and third floor plan if you check this like this is a first and third which have no balcony so that is the same and uh, if you check second and fourth that will be the same like second and fourth so if you see um, and there's no terrace at all uh, this side it's a Mumbai mostly it's sort of not it should be a terrace above um, um, it should be not below it should be a terrace above so there is a mistake uh, in AutoCAD plan in drafting so we have to concentrate on plan as well as uh, front elevation so I start this plan I don't want all this information I'll work on this plan and uh, front elevation so what I do is I'll go to tools and uh, I'll go to quick select I don't want so much of text it's so much of confusing right uh, either you can uh, of the layers of this uh, text but what I'll do is I'll say M text select all say ok delete I don't want M, M text as well and then I'll go to tools and I'll say quick select now I'll say text previously was M text now it will be a text I'll say select all now text has been selected everywhere I don't want I'll say delete and if you see if you select this you will see dim I don't want dim layer because it's so much of confusing either you can go to layer palette the layer palette shortcut is LA LA and you can press enter so I don't want dim I'll say off say turn off fine this is a section line that also I don't want it say section line I don't want and off so the action plan is I want boundary lines like this see uh, we are making an exterior so we don't need actually uh, the inside information of the building so uh, like we don't require this stairs in uh, you know information as well so I just delete this windows or you can hide it say windows I'll say go to text text is fine text is deleted basically it's a windows WM windows say off don't want this line we want continue line as continue line so I'll say delete this is a continue line and right now we are not taking any balconies we are just taking a inside wall so we want the continue because it's a opening so what I'll do is select it's a wall layer so I'll click and say wall it will be a current I'll take line for line I'll press L and say enter still dim is on current layer say layer palette and wall I'll say current this is a set current now I'll take line L enter 
I'll just delete this. Now this is continue. No need this. This one and we don't need this uh, separation line because we'll make a different uh, box or diff take a different wall from front. So the whole idea I'll, I'll tell you later. Now I'll just extending this line. The extending is EX, enter, select, press shift, uh, spacebar and I'll just click done don't want this line so I'll delete it now I don't want from this can add this I say EX again and I'll extend it now I'll say I don't want this line so trim TR enter select confirm it I play pressing space bar that's the ex this wall we want so I'll just trim it tr this we want and again these guys I don't want and say extend ex delete and say trim tr enter select delete so this we want can delete it this even this is clear clear this one is cleared this is backside actually I don't require any details on backside because my view is from left side left hand side like this and uh, we are taking one uh, human eye view so no need to work on extreme right back back side because it will take too much time as well you can save the time when you are doing projects so leave this one whatever the details have but from here we need I'll just list this one Still safer side I'll make this one. So EX for extend command and stream it TR fine. We know require this one. Fine. If you see this, these are the uh, balcony sections uh, which have been shown over here. The back side and the front side. So I'll make one layer now. I'll say L A enter. I'll make one layer. You can press Alt N as well to get new layer. This is a new layer. I'll say 3 D underscore wall sorry w a l l wall let's say current take a yellow color because it should be very bright you can see what's uh, it's happening or not so for filling boundary i'll say b o on my keyboard or you can go and uh, uh, draw from draw you can say boundary as well pick points one by one will start picking points by clicking 
you can press enter and in this case i want this continue i'll just say again control z i'll rectify it say so ex i'll delete this one i'll say continue wall tr Even this we want. We are, we are not talking this balcony. We'll take this one as a TR, and we are not taking this one. So we are getting this line, this this wall, and this wall, because if you see a close look, uh, we have see this area is this one. So we have a balcony. Uh, one, two, three. One, two, three. four so we have all four balconies so there is no question of alternate balconies over this row so we have to keep in mind so we are taking this one and this one as well but we are not taking this one big whole wall what i have said on this time so we don't want this wall so here is the same rule applies we want this wall and we don't want this one if you see Again, we have continuous balcony one, two, three, and four. Here is alternate. Here is alternate. So make one continue first. So E X. Let's delete this one. Say trim T R. If you have any doubts, you can press X L. Enter and say V E R vertical. If you align this one, you can get to know which balcony. we are actually speaking but in this case in this case uh, the drawing has been shifted little bit so if you check excel and ver this so i'll just take another line excel say ver this is our end point of the balcony or pillar as well so if you select the whole plan and say move m enter then i'll just select Say move. Stick one more line Excel and vertical V E R. Move. Select. Delete all those lines. Again, Excel and say vertical V E R. Now, if you see, this is what we are doing now. So, to take a clear picture in your mind, you can do this because, frankly speaking, when we get the plans from the client or from the architects, it is very very messy, and always you will not get a whole. proper aligned plan in autocad so my suggestion is always uh, do cross check what what you are doing by aligning uh, by aligning this uh, vertical lines construction lines so we have a got clear idea so now this is this this balcony is a continuous one 
two, three, four. So again, I'll show you here. Excel V E R. Here as well and here as well. So we have continuous balconies. One, two, three, four. So in this case, we need this one, and we know we are not taking this one because we are giving uh, it will it will extrude everything. So only we want side walls. So in this case, I'll go in layer palette again. I'll make wall current. Only wall current. Just make uh, extend E X. Here, E X. Here. So sorry, we want till here. E X. Here. So T R don't want this one. T R trim select and yeah. So this is clear. And now this one. I'll not, I'll not uh, arrange uh, again a construction line because you have uh, got a clear picture what I'm doing. So we want this side wall and this side wall. I'll say trim T R. Say trim here. That's it. That's it. And we don't need this wall. Here is done. So I'll delete this one and I'll make my current layer that is 3D wall. And I'll start doing the boundaries. I'll say B O boundary and select this area. Wow. Now it's continuous, so it will happen properly. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one. And again, it's here and it's here is not there. Again, I'll just cross check it. X L and B E R. How we have not done this? Take T R. This one. So again, we'll do say boundary and yeah. Now it's clean and clear. What? We are doing and say enter will fill the boundary and the rest part will do the same in this case we have to do it because it's not total uh, it's a left hand side back area it's not right hand side back so i'll say tr this one and this one and the rest of all i don't care even uh, there is uh, that doesn't come under my view so I'll say boundary this one this one this one this one just for namesake we can click click here that's it so this is the first part in next part we'll continue with the our next work with autocad as well 3d max so thanks for watching my first lecture meet you in second part